Welcome. In front of me is a ZTE Blade A72S and today I'll show you how you can copy contacts from your SIM card to the phone. To get started you will need to open up the standalone contacts application which is located in the Google folder. Once you have that open, you can navigate to Fix and Manage and then select, let's get rid of this. Uh, and here you can select import from SIM, which actually I don't see this kind of option right here. Let's see under fix and manage, do we have something? No. Import from file just gives me the two options. Manage SIM, oh, there we go. So as you can see, it's very weirdly named called manage SIM. So I assume this is, yeah, uh, where we import our contacts. So by default, it will opt into saving to our Google account if you're logged into one. Obviously, I am, which you can see right here and here. Now, it only shows me contacts that are right now on the Google account. It looks like there's no contacts on the device itself, just on the Google account. So anyway, I'm going to go back in here. Uh, now, as you can also see, it almost disables all the contacts apart from two. And that is because all these contacts actually exist on my phone already. So the device is just trying to prevent importing duplicate contacts. Now it's not doing this all that well, considering these two also exist. So, you know, it's kind of missing one, but whatever. Now, uh, outside of that, you can tap on the drop down right here and also change it to save your contacts to the device as an example, which uh, because there are no contacts on the device, it automatically selects all of them because none of them are on the device. So I'm going to stick with the device option, select import. This will import obviously all the selected contacts. And from here, if we go back to contacts now, before I do so, it does bring up this uh, pop up right here. Keep and backup and sync off. So I'm just going to select keep off just in terms of like Google. I don't really care. So once we have our contacts list, we can then click on this account icon right here and navigate to, as you can see, a new option showed up device and here you can see all the contacts that I have imported. So there we go. Now, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.